guys welcome back to my channel we're getting right into your reading today we have marriage and concern as well as imprisonment here all right Aquarius so, so as you can see we have angel number 333 is saying to make a decision here the path for is being cleared out for you you could be married and feeling imprisoned in your marriage and this holds off for concern you could also be in a long-term relationship with someone and you want marriage but you don't feel like it's ever going to happen you know you want change in this relationship it's kind of like you're tired of defending yourself and sticking up for what you want empress energy your energy is in reverse so feminine energy is completely off right now you're not getting the emotional love that you want and you're kind of tired of speaking up on that and it's kind of pushing you out to make a change you know and as you're doing so occurs you're maturing as a mature woman and your journey is um being set like you can feel a new beginning is coming in you're vi you're vibrating to a higher level and as you do this you're wondering if the person that you're with is going to be along for the ride we do have the Ace of Cups energy. There is strong love between you and your person. Your person definitely has feelings for you, but financially, if you're dealing with the Capricorn, Virgo, or Taurus energy, you don't know if they're going to uphold on that same level. The Palace of Coins is in reverse. Virgo energy is in reverse. Um, the Palace of Coins is actually living together, being in a home, and financially is lopsided. We do have the World card, so you're keeping this hidden, this new journey that you are that you are on, this change, this person is keeping this hidden. Um, they're kind of waiting on the universe to handle this with the world and the tree of life. You're kind of um, holding yourself back with the hangman, because you have the power right now to manifest exactly what you want, Aquarius, in regards to love and money you know the universe is giving you this ability to make decisions and change because you are um growing on your own i feel like this is a lot of love here with this person you guys could have grew up together or met in high school or college and um, been married or dated for so long but this person is mature in their emotions here and the, the intimacy there is amazing it's great but it's like you want more emotionally here emotionally is dead you know, the cups are here because it's past love. It's, it's past, not past love, but it's like you guys have so much past history together. It's keeping you bonded here. But in reality, you're being forced, pushed, not forced, but pushed to move on towards a different path. So the page of wands is showing up. You could have a child with this person, which is, you know, the love that you share that's keeping you guys together. Um, financially, you're kind of giving this person another chance. This could also be someone who put their work in um before you and now they're kind of realizing that work isn't enough they want more they want love they want passion they want stability and a new beginning and they're just trying to manifest this with you it could be in the dating or talking stage with this person they want more capricorn energy um this other scenario doesn't have to necessarily be um you know you wanting emotionally attention here this person this new person that you're dating, it's like you're nothing like they had in the past. You're very upfront with what you want, and you're not settling until you get that. You guys are going to be going out a lot talking about the past, and this is going to attract this person uh, more towards you. You're going to bond over your childhood history, your, um, your family morals, if you guys are on a talking stage right now for six of cups. You guys could have just been dating for about six weeks. There's a lot of passion between you guys. There's so many energy yeah this marriage situation you, you're kind of holding on to a thin thread because you do have kids involved there were happier times you are trying to be mature about the situation could be dealing with a Taurus. you know you're holding on to the fun times the memories you had guys had share we have the six of cups and the three of cups which is the nine of cups so there there was a fulfilling bond here that you guys had you know Someone could be watching you trying to figure out how to balance things out with you. They're going through karma, dark night of the soul with the five of cups in reverse. They really regret their actions and how they hurt you. You could discover that they potentially had a kid. Gemini, Libra, Libra Aquarius kid. Um, could have been dealing with a karmic. This person was very manipulative and had them in a very uh, toxic situation. They have overcome this and this is... Why this regret is coming in, they could be watching you on social media, live your life, being very attractive, living in your light because you chose this new beginning for yourself and they're kicking themselves, right? 
because they have awakening you're awakening as well you're starting off to a new journey this could be a divine masculine trying to come in and speak up about this but the Nine of Pentacles, they don't know how you're going to take this apology. I want to see what this Knight of Pentacles in reverse have to say. Like, it's the Ace of Wands, is here, the Page of Pentacles. The timing just wasn't right for us. Okay, that's what I was getting. So Knight of Pentacles is the slowest moving car in the tarot deck. So on this in reverse, it just... Again, it wasn't the right time, and this is how they're going to say their apology here. How, you know, they have everything with, that they kind of want in their lives, but they feel empty inside without you. And they're going to apologize and just ask you out or talk to you on the phone and saying, you know, I'm sorry for ghosting you. Or I'm sorry for not being there for you. You know, I was focused on my career. The timing just wasn't right. I apologize. The universe is um, pushing them to uh, listen to their intuition and come forward and say this to you. Because like I said, at one point, this was a fulfilling connection. You guys had a lot of chemistry and attraction there. The, the beginning was great. A lot of love, passion. Yeah, but now it's like anxiety. Hopefully that this person can heal this because this was a hot new start. But now this is a journey with this other connection here that you're leaving behind, this relationship. You're going to get... Um, your emotional fulfillment, you are going to heal from this. It's just going to take some time. And that's okay. So be patient with yourself. Open your heart and don't be so defensive. Feel what you feel inside. Because that will only lead to resentment and a bitterness. Aquarius is saying to be mindful in this King of Cups energy. Get a hold of your emotions. And if you have to journal how you feel, because I'm telling you, those pent up energies, emotions are not fun, all right? So I'm going to lead tension in the body and mind, right? And lead to stress. So get that stress out. Why is the six of swords energy? And we have to leave and detox for a minute. Go on a road trip. Go take a drive to the store here. Get out of this delay, this funk that you're in. Because I feel like for some, it's not even your energy. It's this person's energy. Again, they're feeling unstable and it's without you. For some, you have them blocked. And the real world have completely um, came crashing down. Because they're wanting to talk to you and give the stable offer. But you're nowhere to be found. We have the Ace of Cups, the Ace of Wands, and the Ace of Pentacles here. <laughs> But look at you showing up as the Queen of Swords and Aquarius with the Empress in reverse. You're like, hell no. This is above me now. Three of Pentacles in reverse. You do not want to work this out. This is a lost cause. You know, you feel like you didn't deserve this, which you did not. But again, it's kind of hard for you to move on, but you're taking that path to do so, right? Because this person, again, Queen of Cups in reverse. You are emotionally drained and depleted from this person. It's time for you to take a step back. Get into this hermit mode and really decide on what you want with the world, the mature woman, and the journey. You have this beautiful pathway ahead of you, Aquarius, so definitely take that. Yeah, I'm so attracted to you. We know that with that Queen of Wands showing up. I wonder if you are happier without me. I know I was distraction from your pain. And again, you and I were too young, so it brings me back to this high school childhood love that this person kind of wants to come back to. But again, you could be married. And stuck in a marriage, you met this person again. And this concern, because it's like, you kind of want to divorce from this um, other person, but you know it's going to be rocky because kids aren't involved. So, ooh, curious, tricky situations here. All right, I'm going to leave it there, guys, and have a great week.